This is on 9-11 itself, when he reports live that the FBI's working theory at that point is that, quote, at the same time two planes hit the building, there was a car or truck packed with explosives underneath the building, which exploded at the same time and brought both of them down. So that according to him, the FBI had an explosion theory. And when we look at the television footage from that day, we find it's not just the FBI. There were police officers talking about explosives in the building. There were firefighters talking about a theory of explosives in the building. It was all over the place. Reporters, everything. So that's the first point that I wanted to make today. And it's a simple point, And it's really nice to be able to prove something. You can prove beyond any shadow of a doubt that the theory that the buildings were brought down through controlled demolition, both in the broad and the narrow sense, that is that they were brought down, sorry, through explosions, whether they be natural explosions in the building or explosives, these theories were very common on 9-11. Now I go to my second point. There is substantial eyewitness evidence supporting the explosion hypothesis. And here's where I actually try to build the case that there were a lot of witnesses and that some of this testimony or this, these statements are quite detailed. They're rich. And they tell us a great deal. And I thought it might be useful to divide this up into two sections. One in which I talk about quality and one in which I talk about quantity. By quality, I mean I'll just look at a few short uh, eyewitness statements which are rich and detailed and, uh, and uh, we'll just talk about them for a few minutes. A couple of these video clips you've seen before, but we'll look at them again. And then quantity, I'll try and give a, a kind of overview of you know, how many witnesses we're talking about here. All right, so we begin with the famous clip from the Nade Brothers film, uh, the two French filmmakers who were there on 9-11 and who uh, interviewed people and so on. So this is from the day. Uh, the gentleman, the uh, firefighter on the right is Dennis Tardio, and on the left is Pat Zoda. And let's listen to their description of what the North Tower, because we have to be specific here, what the North Tower looked like as it came down. Yeah, that is it. Yeah. All the way down. I was watching and running. Just ran up with it. And then you just sort of, this cloud of shit. 